Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum dan selamat sejahtera. Thanks for Nadi Tech Juris and organizer for this opportunity. Okay, at Labs, okay, we built this app named PTSB Model and the research paper is called uh, Android Application for Student Grading System Using Firebase. I'm Inta Shafinas, uh, Piti Abdul Razak from Polytechnic Tuan Kusultan Abahiyah and my student, Ramakrishnan uh, Manuheran. Okay, basically, uh, this app has uh, two panels. Okay, the first one is lecturer panel. Okay, lecturer can assign the assignment, submit marks and add class notes and chat with the students in this app. Okay, other than that, the student panel also uh, give uh, the ability to student to submit the extended uh, assignment and view the assessment. Okay, later on, we will give a demonstration to you on uh, this application. Okay, this uh, methodology okay, consists of four stages. The first stage is analysis. Okay, in analysis, we plan, we draw the interface and we identify the data that connected between the uh, two uh, student and uh, lecturer panel and the second stage is design stage okay is about to uh, be code and giving an uh, comment instruction for the application using xml file okay for the interface layout the third phase is development phase. We sync the Android apps and the Google Firebase. Okay. Then the last one, the implementation. Okay, after all this uh, have been done, okay, we convert the file to executable file to do the uh, implementation and error checking. Is uh, the results okay? As you can see, is at the login page okay? Then uh, the lecturer panel and also the student panel. Okay. The code of these apps is a reduced hassle for student and lecturer okay? Because of using the database okay, specifically is no loss of data, and student also can uh, view their uh, grid okay? Selamat sejahtera kepada para juri yang dikasih. Saya Rama Krishna Manokaran dari kelas Digital. Saya dari Jabatan Ko Juru Terang Electric dari Politeknik Tuan Ko Sultan Abahiyo. So, jom kita buka aplikasi kita dulu. Okay, saya dah buka aplikasi. Kita ada dua option, lecturer dan student. Untuk phone Vivo ini kita akan guna sebagai account lecturer. Untuk phone kecil Samsung ni kita akan guna sebagai phone student. So, let's login into lecturer first. So, kita dah masuk login, uh, login page lecturer. Kita dah sign in, sign up. So, untuk first time lecturer guna application ni, dia boleh sign up. Dan untuk pembentangan video ni, saya dah already sign up on the, uh, atas nama SV saya. So, saya akan login kepada uh, account Puan Intan Syavinas. So, email yang saya buat adalah ptspmodel.gmail.com So, kita tekan sign in. So, selepas tekan sign in, kita dah sign in sebagai lecturer panel. So, uh, when a lecturer first time login into application, lecturer boleh masuk uh, profile button, profile, and then lecturer boleh tentukan uh, nama yang akan dipapar dalam application, number phone, address, dan email, dan juga lecturer boleh update password. Okay, so pada uh, butang ini, uh, kita boleh actually edit subjek uh, lecturer. So, lecturer boleh edit subjek yang beliau aja. So, dalam uh, case ni, dia uh, Puan Intan Syafinas, Mengajar saya internet based controller So we leave it as internet based controller Okay so uh, subject data saya successfully So dalam ini Dalam uh, lecturer's panel kita ada Submit assignment Lecturer boleh submit assignment untuk student Submit markov So selepas uh, student submit balik uh, assignment uh, Submit uh, answer sheet mereka So lecturer boleh submit markov kepada answer sheet uh, student Dan juga lecturer boleh submit notes Dan lecturer ada feature inbox iaitu student boleh chat dengan lecturer so lecturer boleh receive message dan boleh reply message dan juga profile dan juga add student kita tengok uh, view existing student so contohnya saya Ramakrishnan Changka so saya dah add from student kita tekan student so welcome to PTSB model so kita perlu login ID dia so Ramakrishnan punya ID iaitu saya 16 DTK 19F1035 3 times to uh, lecturer add student mereka akan uh, ada account mereka sendiri 
Cela. So jom kita submit assignment kepada student. So kita tekan submit assignment. Dalam submit assignment, lecturer boleh submit quiz, test, practical test, practical lab dan continuous assessment. So lecturer dah tengah uploading file untuk quiz satu. Okay, quiz satu ibc.pdf sudah di upload dan lecturer tekan add quiz. So dalam Rama Krishna ni dia akan receive quiz yang lecturer submit. Tekan assignment, the same uh, option akan muncul. Quiz, test, practical test, practical lab, continuous assignment. Lecturer boleh submit everything from this. Krishna sekarang boleh tekan quiz satu IBC PDF ni untuk download soalan yang lecturer upload. Quiz satu IBC, due date, due time, student ID dia uh, ni uh, 16.19.1035 iaitu saya, saya yang submit. So, lecturer boleh download answer sheet student Ramakrishna ni. Klik to download quiz PDF file. Okay, dia akan uh, redirect kepada Google Chrome ataupun browser. Okay. Okay, dekat sini ada download. So, lecturer boleh download uh, ni kertas jawapan assignment. Student dah bagi answer, uh, answer kepada assignment. Student dah upload answer. So, lecturer dah marking. So, student boleh tengok markah yang dia dapat untuk quiz. So, tekan marks. Dekat sini ada. Zoom in sikit. Okay, ini profil saya Ramakrishnan. Saya yang sama quiz tadi. So, puan dah markah. Due date, due time. Assignment dia. Quiz 1 IBC. Saya dapat 320 feedback. Very bad. So, untuk semua assignment dalam ini. Dalam ini, student boleh dapat tahu. Semua assignment markah yang dia perolehi. So, selepas lecturer add notes. Semua student yang lecturer add dalam kelas tadi, kelas tadi akan receive notes tersebut. Contoh, dalam akaun saya, akaun student ni, saya tekan notes, saya dah ada uh, notes yang uh, lecturer upload tadi. So, saya tekan, saya tekan download. So, automatically uh, sama. Step yang sama, saya tekan download, saya dah download. Da, uh, dah download, download uh, notes yang lecturer bagi tadi. Uh, Arduino, Arduino notes. So, contoh. Okay, so saya uh, sekarang boleh masuk kepada uh, aplikasi lagi. So, kita dah tengok submit markah, submit assignment, notes dan juga sekarang kita akan tengok chat with lecturer. Student boleh, ini account student, student boleh chat with lecturer. So, kita tekan chat with lecturer. Uh, ini lecturer saya, iaitu uh, ini lecturer saya, Puan Intan Syafila, Internet Based Controller. So, saya tekan, Hai Puan, bila kena... Uh, account Puan akan dapat push notification Tengok uh, Ramakrishna send you a message Style Lab 1 bila kena hantar So lecturer boleh buka inbox So boleh reply kepada Ramakrishna so, Belum ada something unique for our polytechnic Polytechnik Tuanku Sultanan Bahia So sebab itu saya create application ini Dan uh, saya rasa application ini dapat membantu semua lecturer Sebab dalam application ni Lecturer boleh submit zoom in sikit Lecturer boleh submit quiz, test, practical test, practical lab, continuous assignment. Semua lecturer boleh up upload. Add continuous assignment. Add practical lab. Add practical test. Add test. Add quiz. Semua lecturer boleh buat. Dekat sini, apa-apa uh, soalan yang uh, lecturer add de dalam uh, profile student, student pun boleh dapat tahu. No quiz, no test, no uh, practical test. Selepas uh, lecturer add semua soalan, Uh, student boleh receive everything and then student boleh submit dalam application juga. So, kita tak perlu jumpa lecturer dan buat ma everything manually. Everything is on phone now. So, student boleh uh, cepat uh, mendapat tahu markah mereka. Macam ini. On the spot, dia boleh tahu. Quiz satu, student tu saya dapat apa. Contoh dalam ni, account saya ramah kerja. Saya dapat apa. 3 per 20 je. Very bad. So, saya boleh improve. Macam tu. So, this application is Very useful for our polytechnic lecturers. I have created this application only for our polytechnics good. Submit dalam application juga. Disave dalam database ini. Contohnya assignment. Assignment. Ni tadi uh, lecturer bagi satu assignment kepada saya. Iaitu quiz. So ini pun semua ada. Instruksi yang lecturer bagi. Uh, subject. Uh, full name uh, ke kertas solat. Everything ada save dalam database. Dan juga submit the assignment. Submit the assignment ni dari student. Submit the assignment dari student pun dia ada save dalam uh, database juga. Quiz 1, ABC, feedback, very bad. Every single detail has been saved to this database and then this database is very secure. Even the notes. Look at the notes just now we uploaded to the application. 
Arduino Rose, it is also saved. And then the chatting. Whatever we chat, apa benda yang kita chat dengan lecturer dan lecturer chat kepada student juga di save dan Thank you.